The In Focus Ed Ruscha exhibition uh, looks at the work of Ed Ruscha, an artist from um, Oklahoma City, but here now in Los Angeles since the late 1950s when he came to art school at the Chouinard Art Institute. He is well known as one of the first of the pop artists, uh, had a show here in Los Angeles in 1962 um, as part of the group, and has become very well known for his paintings of words and um, everyday icons, such as gasoline stations, or the 20th Century Fox uh, logo. The exhibition focuses on his photographs from the 1960s and beyond. The most important aspects of his artistic production were the artist books that he began making in 1963, the first of them being 26 gasoline stations. These created a new precedent because they were mass produced on high speed offset lithographic presses in editions of several hundred. And whereas Previous artist books had been very valuable, high-end production, limited editions. This really was something new, using ordinary photographs that Ruche took himself um, while on the streets of vernacular architecture, whether it be gasoline stations, um, apartment buildings, empty lots, etc. When Ruche was first making the books, um, he usually thought of the title and the content before he actually took the photographs. And so, for example, in the case of 26 gasoline stations, he had the title in mind and the cover of the book designed before he took a single photograph. It's only now, 50 years after the publication of 26 gasoline stations, that he recognizes the value of the photographs in and of themselves as objects that really represent the time that he was taking them. Rouché might be thought of as the sort of intersection of pop art and conceptual art. And by using photographs in these photographic books, he really brings those two aspects together.